Welcome to the StealthWatch tutorial series. My name is Mike Moyard and I'm a technical solutions architect for StealthWatch at Cisco. In this use case, I will familiarize you with the network visibility module and its integration with StealthWatch, along with rapid threat containment utilizing Identity Services Engine. AnyConnect is not just a VPN client anymore and has not been for quite a while with its modular approach to providing security services. In this use case, we will focus on the visibility provided by AnyConnect and ICE for rapid threat containment. The requirements for this use case are the following, a StealthWatch management console, a StealthWatch flow collector, Cisco Identity Services Engine, AnyConnect 4.2 or later, and any version of NetFlow meeting the minimum supported fields. Attackers are using innovative tactics such as exploit kits, ransomware, and advanced malware in order to evade detection. Without visibility, context, and control as part of your security features, it's extremely difficult to combat these threats. Organizations today are using as many as 60 standalone security solutions. They don't work together. They are typically point solutions that alone have limited impact against well-funded cyber criminals. And they typically generate vast number of alerts many of which are not related to malware or exploits. On average, large organizations have to sift through nearly 17,000 alerts each week to find the 19% that are security related, and security professionals have time to investigate only 4% of the warnings. The longer the threat goes undetected, the greater the potential for damage. Cisco Rapid Threat Containment using Identity Services Engine and StealthWatch Enterprise lets you go to the heart of what matters, detecting and containing critical threats fast enough so that you can mitigate your security exposure and risk. In this use case, you'll be logging into the remote workstation to demonstrate an attacker logging into a corporate network. The attacker has compromised the laptop with malware and obtains valid user credentials. Employees and contractors regularly take their laptops home to work. While the laptop is protected on your organization's network, it's not protected on their home network. The employees not only does work on the laptops, but browses the web as well. The attacker will use various tools to gain visibility into the network layout of the organization. We are now connected to the corporate network. Now we are going to initiate our scan. The scan reveals an Active Directory server. In order to show rapid threat containment, we will initiate a continuous ping. Now we will switch over to Cisco StealthWatch. Cisco AnyConnect MVM leverages the Network Visibility Flow or Invisi Flow protocol to capture user and endpoint behavior both on and off premise. And BusyFlow collects flows from the endpoints along with a small set of high value data related to each flow originating from the endpoint in a lightweight manner in standard IP fix records. This empowers flow collection solutions to leverage this rich data to create visibility into user and endpoint behavior, as well as long term trending and analytics. StealthWatch captures the flow from the remote workstation and creates an audit record of all the flows inside, moving east-west as well as north-south. From inside of StealthWatch's Security Insight dashboard, we can observe different alarms that are occurring within the architecture. If we select the Concern Index, we can see the various hosts that are concerning. In this particular case, we're looking at 198.19.10.100. That is the IP address of our remote workstation. Select the IP address to pivot into a host report. At the top of the host snapshot report, we can see that there are two alerts that are firing, the concern index and recon. Scroll down to the security events and notice the security events port scans that attributed to this alert firing within StealthWatch. Scroll back up. At this point, we have sufficient information to apply an adaptive network control policy through PXGrid and ICE. 
From the host summary widget, select the edit from the ICE ANC policy and apply the ANC policy stealth watch quarantine and select save. Access the remote workstation. The host VPN connection has disconnected and the ping packets are timing out. Stealthwatch through PX Grid and ICE put this host in a remediation until the security team has time to investigate the incident. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And to learn more about rapid threat containment, go to cisco.com forward slash go forward slash stealthwatch. Thanks again.